Good morning. My name is Maciej Brzezny and I am working in CIS company as a software architect and developer. In this short presentation I want to show introduction to OPC Unified Architecture Address Space and explain how it can be modeled using CIS Address Space Model Designer. OPC Unified Architecture is the next generation of OPC. One of the biggest improvements in OPC Unified Architecture is powerful address space and information model. OPC UA allows uh, for the presentation of real-time process and underlying infrastructure as a consistent information model built up with nodes. The process model is represented by nodes, attributes and their mutual relationships. Therefore, this powerful concept allows us to present in unified architecture not only raw data but also complete information about the process state and process environment. The flexibility of unified architecture ensures that there is no existing or future system that is too complicated to be exposed via unified architecture. But the question arises, how to model the process and make it available via unified architecture? How to prepare a server address space based on the process? Of course, this is a multi-step process, especially when we are working not only on server configuration, but also developing the server software. Based on OPC UA specification and recommendation from OPC Foundation, the following steps have to be done. Preparation of logical model based on real environment. Preparation of model basing on the UPC OPC UA notation. Preparation of XML file that describes the model. Develop of OPC UA server. Let's focus on XML file and server development. The question is what is happening there? The picture shows the OPC Foundation UA SDK approach to server implementation and modeling. SDK assumes that the model is in XML file. Based on that file, the SDK model designer generator is generating the following files. Model implementation and all necessary declaration in C Sharp language. We can add this code file to server source to build a server based on the model. XML initialization. This XML document contains all necessary information required by the node manager class to instantiate any necessary node. XML schema and binary schema. Those files contain information about custom serialization of the types of the user data in model uh, that are model specific. Now the important question arises. How to cr create the XML file? Of course, writing such XML document using one of the common XML editors is a very hard task and error prone. But I think the solution is address space model designer. Let's focus on the modeling task using CAS OPC UA address space model designer. The CIS OPC UA address space model designer allows us to perform the same modeling steps as the OPC Foundation recommends. But the advantages is that all these steps can be done in user friendly graphical interface. The output could be model in XML file or C sharp classes, schemas and other files required directly in server development. Let's see on the example. I'm going to show how to start from real process. It is boiler in this example and end with C sharp, XML and schema files. This diagram shows first approach to the boiler model. The boiler produces steam from the water. It consists of input pipe that feeds the boiler with water, boiler drum where steam is produced from the water, output pipe that outputs produce steams, some controllers like flow controller, lever controller, some transmitters, sensor and relay elements. The next step is to prepare OPC UA address space model diagram. But before we start the modeling, we have to talk about the graphical notation. The OPC UA specification defines a graphical notation for OPC Unified Architecture Address Space Data. It defines symbols that represent node classes from OPC UA. 
The table shows all the symbols from specification and compares them to icons uh, that are used by CAS address space model designer. We have object as rectangle, object type as shadow as rectangle, variable as rectangle with rounded corners, variable type as shadow as rectangle with rounded corners, data type as shadow as hexagon, reference type as shadow as six-sided polygon, method as oval, view as trapezium. As you see, OPC UA graphical symbols are very similar to model designer icons. The OPC UA specification defines also symbols for references, but it is not necessary to go into that details now. This diagram shows the boiler using the OPC UA graphical notation. As in previous diagram, we have the same elements like pipes, drum, uh, controllers, etc. But in compared to previous diagram, this is more precise and more understandable from OPC UA point of view. Now I'm going to focus how to model the boiler in CIS Address Space Model Designer. The address space model designer implements conceptual containers called solution and projects uh, to apply its settings. Any solution contains one or more projects and it manages the way the designer configures, builds and deploys sets of related projects. Any project includes source files containing the model representation and related metadata such as properties and references to other projects. The designer integrated development environment provides tools that help you to edit, manipulate model namespaces and add references to external resources. Additional Address space model designer have built-in type library that contains types defined in the specification. Now we can port the design prepared in previous step to the address space model designer. At exemplary design is shown here. The model is presented on the tree and uses icon that represent the node classes mentioned earlier. At the beginning we have namespace declaration. Those namespaces are used in the model definition. The first namespace, opc.ua, refers to built-in OPC UA types and the second namespace, uh, opc.ua.sample, is used to collect elements from our boiler sample design. After namespaces, uh, the tree contains types and method definition, like boiler drum type, uh, flow to reference type, create method types. Those definitions are used in the boiler model. The main element is boiler type definition. It consists of uh, pipes, uh, drum, uh, controller, just like it was shown before. The last marked element is a boiler instance that is added to the model. Now let's focus on the references. References are used to relate nodes to each other. When modeling the real environment and object relationship, it is necessary to distinguish two relation kind of items. Tightly coupled and loosely coupled. Uh, typically, examples of tightly coupled elements are arrays, records. Because any tightly coupled objects can be processed as a large whole, they are called complex. And to distinguish a strong relationship, we can talk about parent item and its children. See children not in Andres space model design. The example of loosely coupled elements is shown on the picture. Here we have references that uh, shows that the water flows from input pipe to the drum. Finally, when the model is finished, the last step is generation of files that can be used directly in server implementation. The only thing we have to do is issuing the build solution command from the tools menu. The output file like C sharp code um, schemas, XML files are generated automatically. Now I want to talk about some other address space model design features. The first is intelligent OPC UA book. It contains useful information about 
UA specification, address space concept, information model, and development of the OPC UA models. What is more, a smart content positioning system of the help window can follow object selection in the graphical user interface. The content of the book is available online, so it can be continuously improved to follow the specification development process. You can also access this book directly from ComServer Vortal. To do it, find OPC UA ebook icon on the main page. What is more, Ultra Space Model Designer supports 3D visualization of the model and special editors as like state machines, exporting tools and many more. Thank you for your attention. You can find other interesting resources on our ComServer portal. If you want to try the address space model designer, download it directly from ComServer portal. It is available for free.